everyone, so I've been looking forward to doing this video. Today I'm going to be unboxing the February box for Geek Gear. Um, Geek Gear do a range of, well they do a range of boxes. You can either get one-offs like what I've done or you can subscribe. They also have one which is something to do with wizards. I think it's like the world of wizardry or something and they also put up past boxes so they get like a mixture of stuff from the previous boxes and you can buy a past box and um, they have a whole range of stuff and I really do like their company I've had one box before from them and I absolutely loved it um, this month is February so like I said and the theme was adventure I think it's adventure I think the reason I got this one was because of the fact that I saw it had Legend of Zelda and The Hobbit in it and I was like well this is a must have so the box is like a chest and on the back, hopefully it's upside down, it's then tells you like where the, like their Twitter, Instagram and Facebook is and it feels quite heavy, so it's quite full and I'm excited to open it. So you do rip the box, like rip the edge, but I kind of peeked and already ripped it. Like I didn't see what's in there, I was just curious because I said it feels heavy so I thought I'd rip it and see and it's just neatly wrapped up in tissue paper and I can't even open it but it was neatly wrapped in tissue paper and I peeked I haven't properly seen what's in it though, I just had, I, it was basically I opened it and just a hmm, it looks full kind of thing I was excited, what can I say so let's open it up, so it's nicely wrapped up in tissue paper and I'll put it on the floor to make it easier so I can just grab them the first thing that I see is Star Wars. Uh, I still haven't seen any of the Star Wars films. <gasps> oh no. I think this is maybe a lightsaber. Looks like, is it? Yeah, I think so. So it's like a lightsaber. Um, it's got crap on the bottom of that. Pencil case. Good quality though. Um, If I ever get around to watching Star Wars, who knows? I might actually end up liking Star Wars. But for now, never seen it, so I don't really care for it. So this will go as a raffle prize, probably. But I don't know why, but it has weird gunk on it. It's got like fluff or something stuck to it, which is a bit gross. Like it looks like it's been used or something. Like how much crap is on it? It's probably got fluff or something from in the box. But yeah, nice roomy pants case. It'll be good for a girl or boy for school. Yeah. Yeah. So bye. Okay, next up is going to be the t-shirt. Um, I ordered this in a um, medium, maybe a large. I think I got it in the unisex because I like baggy shirts. I like to have them really baggy and yeah, I don't like the tight ones because these sort of the tops that feel like that. It's like an actual t-shirt, not a strappy top. And I don't like when I feel like, I feel like with an adult, with my actual size, I should be. It's just too, I don't like to have things like tightly around my skin. So, it's just a little random fact for you girl. Um, I do like these though because the t-shirt is really soft. Like, I haven't even looked at it and I like it because it's super soft. And it's quite thin, but so it'll keep you cool. But at the same time, it's the kind of material that does keep you warm. If that makes sense, it keeps you cool, but it keeps you warm. But let's, have, let's show it to you guys first. Does it look cool? Am I going to like it? I don't know why I asked you guys because you can't answer me. But, ooh, I do like it. This is one from The Harvard. So this is going to be I guess in the Hobbit Island, that's pretty cool. I like that. So you've got ugh, dragon at the bottom. Um, I'm just trying to find ones that I can like, show you. Like when Bilbo gets the ring, the a precious. It's, it's like folding on him. Oh, Gollum got folded. There you go. Um, just trying to find some ones. Going off on his adventure. Uh, oh, yep, and there's a troll, so that's a sad thought I saw the trolls on there. This is really good, and like I said, it's going to be baggy on me, which would be perfect, and it means it'll be perfect for work when I want to have a scruffy day where I just wear baggy clothes the whole time at work. So, I'm happy with that. That's a really nice t shirt, it's really, like I said, really nice quality, and I really like it. Like, yay, makes me happy. And um, what should I get for next? It's like a little bit, Ooh, what do I do for? I'm going to close my eyes and just pick some. So much in here. Okay, I've got one of the small items. So this is a button badge. I actually love badges and pins. Issue is a Star Wars vein. I'm gonna say a Star Wars. Into like the death thingy, Death Star? 
Possibly, I don't know. What is it? I think, is it this? I don't know. It looks like something like the Death Star or something. It's like a ball. I don't know why I'm even trying to explain it because I don't know what these are. But yeah. So it's a bit like on my disappointment pile. This is my side that I like and this is the side that I don't care about. So let's go for something else. We have a little box. Oh, this is cute. It's like a little surprise. So you've got loads of surprises and then you have a present inside of a present. Oh, this is cute. Oh, and it's all wrapped up as well. Oh, this is adorable. I like the box. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. There you go. It's a necklace! That I've managed to tangle up just by dropping it. Ah, or was it tangled already? What the heck? Okay, I'm gonna guess. Have some tissue paper, Wiggles. I'm gonna guess this is from Assassin's Creed. Oh, I'm gonna drop it. I think it's Assassin's Creed anyway. Assassin's Creed is like our weird little like pointy hook thing, isn't it? It looks like Assassin's Creed. It's shiny though. Look at it shiny. Shiny, shiny, shiny. Kind of looks like, like, it's quite, quite, it feels quite solid now. And how it feels, it kind of feels like it could be used as a bottle opener. I don't know why I'm using my finger as a bottle opener. But that's how it feels. I think as Assassin's Creed. I feel sorry for the, like, I bet you everyone's like, oh no, you idiot, it's not Assassin's Creed. But I think it is. It's gonna, it'd be very long though, like. Because it's on my neck, let's bring it to about here. It's gonna be very long. But, yeah. I like the chain though, I might use the chain for something else. Okay, let's go for this big tube. We have a tube. I like tubes because it usually means posters. Or I could be a pirate. Arrgh. Should I do the rest of the video looking for a tube? I don't know what's going on with me today. Ah. Ooh, 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 ooh. It says stuff on it. Geek gear. Oh, these are geek gear exclusives. I'll show you the back first. I showed you a back and then I saw the front and that's awesome. <gasps> okay, I'm going to show you this one first. I really actually know I've got cat hair on my nose, I think. <sighs> Wiggles. Molten. This is really cool. So, Breath of Wind is coming out soon because it's nearly March, which means it's nearly out. And I did wonder if they'd do something to Breath of Wind. And they have. This looks awesome. Oh, this looks like really awesome. So this is one of the posters. I can't, like, it's rolling. But that is really cool. Like, super cool. Do you know what sucks though? I'm not getting a Nintendo Switch, so I can't afford it, and I'm not getting Breath of the Wind, because I can't afford it, so I'm not going to get to play it when everyone else does. I'm going to have to stay away from the internet for like a month or two until I can afford it. And this one as well. These are really cool posters. Like, I really love it. I'm sorry, look. These are awesome. I don't have any space for them though. It's annoying. But... Like they are so cool. Like where the hell am I gonna put them? Well, this room hasn't got any space at all. But they're awesome and they're good quality as well. Like it's quite thick paper and they're like laminated. -y. Laminated? Oh, it's not laminated, but you know what I mean. They look awesome. I'm really happy with those. Like really happy. And then the next thing we want again is Zelda. Woo! I did good. I've got a good box now. So this is a Collector's Edition Hyrule Pen and Pen Topper. So, there you go. I'm gonna say that, that I can imagine that the pen wouldn't be very good though. This is designed as a gift for adults and is not suitable as a toy for young children. It contains a small part. Should we open it then? Maybe not. Oh, my hair's sticking me now. I'm more staticky. Okay, I'm in it. I'm in. No, I'm not. You're in. Hi, hi. I got in. So, it's like a little. Okay, I thought you could take the pen, the like top bit off, but apparently not. It's a twisty pen. See, so ready? Should see if it works. Oh, it's actually quite a good pen. Jeez, it looks like it's a good pen. Hello. Why to? Hello, YouTube. See, it's quite a good pen, and it's black. Okay, I actually thought it was going to be quite crap, but I'm... Good pen. Good pen, good pen, good pen. Okay, ugh. Okay, another thing that I'm not going to like. <laughs> Star Wars 3D coasters. There's eight different ones, and... That's how you pick all this. If you like wobbling, maybe. Three, eight, like new. 
It's looking there, it's looking there, it's looking there. Feel the force. Now, I would get them out to show them all to you, but like I said, this will probably be used as a raffle prize or something, so I'm not going to show them to you, but you can see them on the back, kind of. Like, they look pretty cool. That's strange why I felt so heavy, though. Eight different ones. Hmm. Awesome. I need to watch Star Wars by the looks of it. Okay, the next thing is going to answer my thing about the necklace. This is Assassin's Creed stickers and look as a symbol so i was right it was assassin's creed so so and then also in here we've got another little thing so i'm gonna get it out this? this is just like another print oh yeah geek gear exclusive print kind of looks like a girl in this picture that's pretty cool though cool print but if you look link kind of looks like a girl like seriously <laughs> he does look quite like a girl in this print that's quite a nice print though. See, I've had more space for a print than I do of a poster, so that's cool. I'm going to say that probably the same art, but yeah. That's what's cool. Hey, wigs. So, there you go. And then we have a little booklet thing that tells you all about it. So, it was Adventure, and it says thank you. A big thank you from everyone at Geek Gear for subscribing to our February Geek Gear box. I didn't subscribe, I got a one-off. This year seems to be flying by as we ship yet another month's worth of boxes. We hope everyone has a good year so far. Thanks, your Geek t Gear team. So then he says, behold the t-shirt of The Legend of Zelda, Breath of, Wa Breath of the Wild. I said Breath of Wind, didn't I? Ooh. Uh, it's, it's late. It's like bedtime for me. And I didn't go to bed until like four in the morning this morning. So I'm tired. Like, that's probably why my video is really random. So Legend of Zelda print. You've got the posters. You've got the pen. And it just tells you, ooh, that's cool. You know the necklace I, I showed? One in every 100 subscriptions will receive a black version. <gasps> black version, ooh. I weren't special enough, though. Um, and then you can have three different sorts of badges. There's three options. I got the crappy grey one. I would have preferred a colourful one. I'd more like it, probably. We hope you enjoyed our February box. For hints of upcoming boxes and prizes, please, please follow us on our social media pages. Facebook.com slash Geeky Craft Stuff. Twitter.com slash Geeky Craft Stuff. Instagram.com slash Geek Gearbox. February prizes. Oh, those would have been nice. For February, we're giving two lucky subscribers either the first four figures, Gand Gandalf figure with, worth nearly £100, or the Noble Collection Hobbit let Letter Opener set worth over a £60. We're also giving away over 100 pop vinyls. More prizes. We're giving away an extra 100 plus prizes this month to our subscribers. Star Wars Lava Lamps and Wall Clocks. Oh, wow. I don't care about the Star Wars stuff, but they have some good prizes. Why didn't I win? And then, if we continue, congratulations to all our Geek Gear win um, winners. So these will be about one last one. Check out our talented subscribers. He does some pretty awesome unboxing videos and just tells you a YouTuber. Um, the theme for March is Arcade. So I'm guessing it's like Pac-Man and Vaders and everything. And then it says, when using I Love Geek Gear, you automatically give us the permission to use your picture to publish in our monthly brochure. Even if you cancel your subscription, but you still post a picture of the last box you receive, you still have a chance of winning the prize. Prizes are posted separately from your normal subscription box, usually within one to five days after the the subscription boxes have been posted. Prizes are picked at random and are not related to the monthly theme. Harry Potter subscription will receive a Harry Potter related prize and Geek Gear will receive a Geek related prize. It is not according to the theme. And it's just got questions and that. And yeah, that's the brochure. So now that I've probably completely bored you all to death, we'll do a little summary. So, Star Wars stuff, um, Assassin's Creed stuff, <laughs> Hobbit stuff, and Zelda stuff. Woohoo! That was probably the most creepiest face ever. So I don't really know what my favourite thing was. I really did like the prints. Um, but they do make me sad because like I said, I'm not going to get to play the new Zelda game for a good few months and that makes me sad. So I, I'm going to say the t-shirt was my favourite thing just because Zelda stuff has made me sad. But yeah, that's everything. If you want to subscribe to Geek Gear, I do recommend them. Unfortunately, I can't because I'm poor and I have no money. But... If you do want to, I will put 
links down below just so that you can subscribe to them and check out what they have because they do have some pretty good content and they do some good boxes and that is everything so okay and due to technical difficulties i am now having to record on my ipad which is why everything's gone a bit different to how it was a second ago um basically all i wanted to do was say if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I do have a range of videos up. I do weekly vlogs and then I have my random Fridays and gaming Sundays. Um, I do have unboxings, I do hauls and then just completely random stuff. If you like this video, do a thumbs up. And if you want to see more unboxings, let me know in the comments below. If there's a box that you recommend, let me know and I'll check it out. Um, that is everything, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time of day. I hope you have been smiling, because that's the most important thing, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.